Yeah, I'm here, shit. You got me waiting outside like I'm a fucking sucker. Man, get your ass here, man. Hurry up. Pull up, man. Yo. I mean, we all got our day to go. It's unpredictable with something that you can't control. But things ain't like it used to be. The streets ain't safe no more. I'm trying to get this message out before I lay below the earth. Hey, what's going Speaking on, of bro? Dollars, yeah. Good with you, man. We finished. You got out this way. Man, you know a couple moves, a couple plays, a little property. Some of these buildings over here, you know. I always got to keep the money moving, even yeah. if it is a time of tragedy. Yeah. Speaking of which, we never really got a chance to talk about everything after finding out Sean got killed and everything. Man, shit just got crazy, man. Storm coming there with all that old disrespectful, crazy ass bullshit. Shit just got wild, man. Yeah. Big bro was one of those I've met, man. Real good dude. Yeah, man, they left my brother in the fucking alley. Man, I know how this game go, man. But my brother ain't deserve shit like that. I thought to just, you know, holler at his mom, but I just, you know, I decided to wait, you know? Nah, we're gonna get a chance to holler at her, man. Speaking of which, don't ever put yourself in between some shit I got going on, my nigga. I know you've been gone from the city for a minute, but you forget who the fuck I was? The fuck you talking about, man? What the fuck you think I'm talking about, man? That shit was Storm. Man, she came in on an old disrespectful ass bullshit. I ain't letting nobody fucking disrespect me, nigga. Nigga, that's Sean's sister, man. How you gonna call Sean your brother, right? Then turn around and mug his sister. Come on now, baby, you was out of fucking line. She grieving too, nigga, that's her brother. Nigga, that's my brother too. And no matter how crazy she is, that's my fucking sister. But don't nobody fucking disrespect me. Look, my nigga, you let your emotion get the best of you that day. Sean getting killed shocked everybody. Of course his sister's gonna be feeling it. Man, who the fuck is you, Dr. Phil or some shit now? <laughs> nah, baby, I'm trying to get this money. Shit, I thought you was too. Hey, nigga, who the fuck you think remember taught you how to get to the money? Who asked who out of town forget who taught you the fucking ropes? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right, nigga. Look, man. I'm all about the respect thing too, but I need you to understand, this is some serious shit you about to get yourself into. Moving some weed, some pills, a little meth here and there, ain't gonna bring you the attention like moving this Colombian, you feel me? Nigga, I've been motherfucking hustling since I was 14. What the fuck is you saying, my nigga? What I'm saying, Nico, is that all that hollering, mugging Sean's sister and shit? Women do some crazy shit when they hurt and they angry, my nigga. Just like that. Word gets out about the source of a new drug epidemic sweeping the city type shit, right? All of a fucking sudden, we got K-9 and DEA units making routine traffic stops in your city, man. It's attention that we don't need. Attention that I don't need, you know what I mean? You're right. But I'm telling you, man. This shit coming straight south. These ain't the type of niggas that's gonna wanna hear some excuses from some emotional niggas that didn't fuck their money up. We need shit to be low-key as possible, man. That's all I'm saying, B. You right about that, man. We definitely need this shit to be super low-key. But I said what the fuck I said, my nigga. I don't give a fuck who they is. Don't nobody motherfucking disrespect me. You did? Hey. My nigga. By the way, Cuz gonna be shooting us up a little trial around here soon. How much? Go all over 30 keys. It's a lot of fucking weight, my nigga. You ready? I'm ready. Sound like you having doubts. I ain't got no doubts, nigga. Shit. I got a couple of thorough niggas we can go through. You know, we gotta move this shit with some niggas we trust, man. Come on now, baby. I ain't new to this shit. You might be. <laughs> I hear you, I hear you. Only thing fucked up about this shit, man, my nigga Sean's supposed to be here for this shit. I mean, man, y'all niggas left the city. Y'all made y'all a little money. I mean, I respect that shit and everything, but me and my nigga was here, man. We was getting it in. Niggas didn't like us. 
Some niggas loved us, some niggas hated us, but everybody respected us. But they was not fucking ready for that shit. I'm always ready for a lot of shit, man, but I wasn't ready enough to come back and bury your brother, I know. Ain't nobody ready for no shit like that, man. It's all part of the fucking game. I just always thought that shit would be me first, though. Now let's get the fuck up out of here, man. This shit hot as fuck.
Danny, I need you to get back home so you can watch Brianna. I gotta be at this funeral. Alright. Yeah. Hey, it's been a whole lot of deaths in my area lately. And it's got me thinking like, before I go, I gotta make an imprint. You never know when it's your time, feel me? Yeah. I mean, we all got our day to go. It's unpredictable, it's something that you can't control. But things ain't like it used to be, the streets ain't safe no more. I'm trying to get this message out before I lay below. The earth is making a couple of dollars. Really worth risking your lifespan and losing your freedom to roam as you please. Don't give it all up to the white man. Nobody thought that we ever could fly, but we didn't came up with a flight plan. My nerves just been a lot better than ever, that's why I keep that on my nightstand. R.I.P. the old man Benny, all he did was pass the knowledge. Told me to watch what I intake, don't be making bad deposits. People dying every day, whether it's from natural causes or just something hella catastrophic. Trying to be the first to go. Man, niggas been hating on us. We had this fucking city on lock. Niggas ain't like that type pressure. Man, I'm sorry. He put the link up and everything, though. Nigga took him out the game, man. Kill my nigga and let them dead in the fucking alley. I swear when I catch them niggas, they dead. Thanks. Hey, I just wanted to come over and pay my respects. No Sean was a good nigga. I know how y'all rock. I appreciate that, man. You know, Sean always said you stand up, though. Yeah. He always did show love whenever he saw me. He's probably got that motherfucker killed in the first place. Mm. I told that nigga he was showing too much fucking love out here. Mm. Think it was somebody he knew? Nah, I can't see that happening, man. Sean was too small for that. <laughs> it's a cemetery full of smart, dumb motherfuckers, man. And of course it was somebody he fucking knew. How else you think they got that close to him? Hmm. You might be right, man. Of course I'm fucking Sh right. Shit. Sean would have seen whoever else coming, man. Damn. Like I said, man. When I came back to the city, thought he'd be making money with my brother. Shit, not burying him. Hey. Still gotta get to the money. That shit don't stop. The last time I saw Sean, that's what we rapped about. Man, look, man, don't you worry about that shit. We gonna get to the fucking money as soon as I kill the niggas that killed my brother. Yo, man, I'm about to go holler at uh, Sean's mom's his sister and his girl. Nah, man, you see Storm crazy ass down there. She be in the whole fucking scene in this shit. Yeah, you right. But I do know Sean to be there for my mom's. True. We'll go check him out once the little homie leave, man. Oh, that's Sean, little homie. Usually whenever you saw Sean, you saw him. Hi. I'm Jeremiah. Sean was my friend. I'm sorry about what happened to him. Hey, Jeremiah. I'm Storm. Sean's sister. I know. I heard you speak about him in there. I know who you are. Sean used to always talk about you. I'm Tasha, Sean's girlfriend. Hi, baby. I'm Sean's mother, Dolores. And you said you were Sean's friend. Yes, ma'am. Well. He was more like a big brother to me. 
He always looked out for me. A big brother. That's nice. How are you doing, Jeremiah? Natasha is right. Sean used to talk about you all the time. And I know you miss him too. I'm doing good. How y'all doing? Well, baby, Sean was my only son. My first boy, my baby boy. And now he's gone forever. So I'm not doing well at all. I'm sorry, Miss Dolores. Sean was a good person. Yeah, he was. But I also know who Sean was. I love my son. And in my eyes, he could do no wrong. However, when I look into your young eyes, I finally see that my baby boy could do some things wrong. <laughs> I know, baby. Sean looked out for you in these streets. Miss Dolores. Oh, baby, I need to say this to him. Are you listening to me, baby? Yes, I am. Are you ready to die? Are you ready for your family to have to bury you too? No. Listen to me. I need, you need to get out while you still can. I sat there in the church and I listened to everybody. Tell me how good Sean was and how he looked out for everyone. But he, he didn't look out for himself. And that's the reason I have to bury him today. I have to put my baby boy in the ground. And if you don't get out today, now, right now, you will be next young man. I'm going to be okay. And Sean would always say that he was okay too. And he wasn't though. Sean told me that you have a little brother and a sister. Yeah, I do. So let him attempt to bury you, too. <laughs> I won't. I'll see y'all later. I hope I wasn't too hard on him. No. He needed to hear the truth. I agree. Storm? Girl, you really gonna act like that with your mama right standing over there? Man, chill the fuck out. Girl. Hey, come on, y'all. We ain't about to do this shit here. Not now. I know we emotional and all that. We ain't about to do this here. You keep him the fuck away from my mama. <sighs> Yo, man. I told you, I told you. You might be right, man. You gotta let Sean's mom's another day. Nah, she's not gonna chill the fuck out. How you doing, Mel? My name is Cass. I was a friend of Sean's. Oh, a friend, huh? Mm. I just wanted to come over and tell you that your son, he was a good man, and that I'm sorry. Hey, Miss D. You remember me? King? I hate we have to see each other like this. Sean was, Sean was like a brother to me. If you need anything, anything at all, just let me know, all right? If I may, we better see you sometime this week, all right? 
You know, Sean wasn't like a brother to me. He was my brother. I should have been there. I'm sorry I wasn't there. Should have been you laying in that alley. Mm -hmm. If you need anything, I'm going to be there for you because I know Sean will be there for me. I'll talk to you soon, Ms. D. I appreciate you boys for coming. I appreciate it. You don't need to thank us. We're supposed to be here. I'm about to see you sometime soon, Ms. D. Take care of yourselves, ladies. I'm about to get up through. You be safe out here, man. Hey, you sit in here too, baby. Mm -hmm. get up with you up to holler at Nico. It's on? Yeah. Baby, I'm ready to go to the car now. Okay, Ms. D, we'll take you. Storm, you ready? Come on, Hey, man, let me holler at you real quick. What? What you mean, what, nigga? I'm just coming to check on you. I know Sean was the big homie and shit. I'm just making sure you're straight. You don't got to worry about me. But I do, man. Because Sean was my nigga, and he would want me to make sure you're straight. Sean ain't here no more, so we ain't got nothing to say to each other. Look, we still don't know who shot Sean. You make sure you're good out here. I'm good, Nico. Whoever killed Sean, they definitely coming for me next. And anybody who's close to me, that means you. I'm not around you, though. You my fucking son, nigga. It don't matter if you regret around me or not. No, they won't, because they ain't going to know. Look, man. Shit always come to light, my nigga. Shit always come to light.